Alrighty, we have early people here. Hello, Tank. Hello, Crash and Trash. How are you doing? And let's see who else we got here. So today I will be playing with my friend Icebreaker Prime, and he has his own channel, which I will definitely put in here in a second. Let me just make sure he's on board, and we are set. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to put it in his channel in the chat. He's almost got a thousand followers, so it's getting there. Hey, Walt Forgiven, how you doing? So yeah, check out his channel, please. Let me copy this real quick and put it in here. Hey, Red says, how you doing? Sign into chat. What? Weird. Weird stuff. Gee, is this thing even on? Man, YouTube is just weird. Come on, YouTube. Come on. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Hello. <laughs> Mr. Loud Keyboard. Yep, that's me. How weird. <laughs> hey, how are you? C hey, CBRD, how you been, man? You still playing Cross Out at all? Uh, a, lot, a lot of people are. Damn, is this thing working? So is this thing even working? I'm having trouble here trying to find this out. Bizarre. No? Yes? <laughs> How strange. All right, let me try this again. I'm having a lot of trouble lately with YouTube. Weird. Oh, yeah. Hello there. How you doing, man? Hey, so I am trying, man. I'm trying to set this thing up. <laughs> yeah, I am too. Still in the game? Cool, yes. Yeah, so I'm talking to CBRD, who is awesome. So, um, so what do we call you anyway? You are Icebreaker Prime in game. What else we got? Wizard TV? <clears throat> um, I got so many names I go by. I need to really yeah. <laughs> brand myself. Very much so, but you're almost a thousand subs, which is awesome. Yeah, that's surprising. You are I'm really, really, really close. That is really cool. That um, is my goal. Nice. Let me just set up a little bit more. All right, so there is his channel in the chat. Please go to that and give him a sub. Thank you for that. Um, I'm also setting my stream up. Unfortunately, I am running on potato settings. Yeah. Quite unfortunate. Red says you stopped playing two months ago. Yeah. I mean, there'll be something new eventually. I would imagine. We will see. Yeah. So I, I don't know. I mean, I was. We were talking last night. I was talking to Icebreaker last night. That um, Crossout is, it's in a weird state right now because we had that last battle pass, which really didn't offer anything for us. So that was a letdown. And Clan Wars, they are messing up badly, apparently, and you don't really want to mess up your bread and butter. So that's happening. Yeah. All right, so you have the Mad Dog. Let me open that up. Cool. Assemble. Let's see, can I assemble it? I don't know. So here we got Mad Dog. And what was your inspiration for Mad Dog? It's just a really interesting or odd collection of weapons and stuff. So uh, that was really interesting. So there is a one trigger and crickets. <laughs> uh, Terrero cab, cheetah engine. So there's a lot of stuff going on and uh, there's absolutely no synergy, which is really hilarious. But there's a lot you can do with stuff like this that people just play with and practice get used to. You don't have to have synergy <laughs> to be good, um, but I thought this was a kind of hilarious combination. Sounds like I lost him on the call. What is this thing? Hyper car driver. That is a cool spider. We honk to you. Hello, sir. And let me see if Icebreaker is in game now. Nope. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah. So what do you think about that? Mr. Loud Keyboard. <laughs> Let's see here. Mm -hmm. So what I could do is, oh yeah. <laughs> what is that mega ramp? Let me show you. Um, it's like a mini game. I suppose you can call it a mini game. And it's not quite finished yet. So I'm going up. He and this is as high as you could possibly build something because yeah i can't build anything on top of this structure it just doesn't let me so you kind of go up and yeah it's kind of scary a little bit you don't really want to fall down here uh and then gracefully you gotta head down and this is the hard part for me so we're going down and now we're going to have to do this little loop, so, okay, don't flip, wee, and then we go up again. And I'm going to keep on doing this for as long as I can. And, um, it's pretty terrifying to go that <laughs> high up. And I actually get the heebie-jeebies, I actually like, feel it in my stomach when I fall off of here. Yeah, he's far out. And what is this guy... I've seen him before. Honest Freddy, I've seen you a lot. I don't know if that's a... Uh, that's not an actual player, I think, but I'll talk to him anyway. So, um... Yeah, I can't find my friend Icebreaker. But anyway, so he's got Mad Dog. Let's see, what am I missing? I'm missing... Oh, the Karita stuff. I don't have a trigger? That's weird. I guess I lost my trigger. Crap. Did I really? No. I thought I had a fuse trigger. I don't, that's weird. Wow, I must have been desperate. <laughs> yeah, so uh, CBRG, that's the thing. The, the new Battle Pass thing is all about this amusement park thing. And mainly you get stuff to put in your garage. You get this thing over here. Um, you have It's really cool. There are all kinds of decor stuff you can put in your garage. Only one spot in the garage, mind you. You can put this little ball in there, the soccer ball. Uh, not a lot of parts otherwise. These crates give you the the decor for the outside. And yeah, and you can get these little cars f just for shooting in your garage. It's And it's kind of like Minecraft. You have these little pieces. So I go through here and I can kind of build stuff. And that's the new Battle Pass thing going on. See? like It's like Minecraft. See, so you have these little pieces you can build and stuff, and if you wanted to. Uh, and you can do little game things, like here's a little game mode thing here. Um, I'll get there eventually. Come on, come on, come on. So I go here, begin skill test, and then I'm, it's kind of, uh, you're on racetrack. And I guess I have to just complete this. Dee -dee -dee. Yeah. Hey, Hurricane. And then you win. And it gives you the finish, the score. So I could make a racetrack if I felt like it, but I don't know. I haven't been that interested in this part of the game so much, honestly. Um, I mean, you can. It's interesting. It's certainly interesting. But it requires a whole new set of currencies and other stuff. And you can't buy the stuff in the market. You have to kind of salvage what you don't want and then... Oh, craft other stuff. Hey, man. Congrats on cross out content. First time you catch me streaming. Cool. Thank you for being here. Appreciate that. Uh, didn't have a lot of plans for today, uh, JC, but I do come here once in a while. Hey, Rip City. How you doing, man? And uh, the idea I was going to play with my friend um, Tater Master, Icebreaker Prime, other things. Uh, let's see. Hey, you still there? No. Okay, I lost my friend over here. So we were going to play together. Let me show you what he's got. Uh, he has a channel. Please look in the com in the chat. I put the link to his channel over there. So he has this thing. It's called Mad Dog. And uh, hey, Reefer, how you doing? And it's really really crazy. So I like to make these things. It, it was called like a like a I guess what was it? Bill Doctor or something. 
and I would talk, I kind of break down builds, and I did that to, to his build before, and kind of gave a lot of tips for new players how to build, and kind of criticizing what they've done. And criticizing is all well and good, but of course, um, of course it doesn't mean crap, it doesn't mean I know what I'm talking about, or anything. But I just kind of give tips based on what I see here, and I can do that with this thing. So, you're a Wither TV's my reader. You told me to watch your stream. Okay, hey man, how you doing? Oh yeah, um, Hurricane, I lost him. Do you know where he is? I was calling on him and then I lost him. I think his PC broke down and I was going to stream with him. But I'm just going to talk about his build, okay? But, cool. <laughs> Who wouldn't watch my stream? A lot of people apparently. <laughs> So uh, what he so let's talk about a few things. Firstly, there is uh, synergy. So in general, you want to have synergy with your stuff. Here is an engine, and he had a trigger and a. I don't have the stuff. So he had uh, a cricket and a trigger. I have a blockchain and a wasp. It's the same thing, right? <laughs> so yeah. You found an orphan kitten? Oh, you're hand feeding it? That's awesome. Oh, good for you, man. Well, that's amazing. I'm really proud of you. I'm super, super proud of you. This is a great time to have a pet, by the way, because we're all kind of alone. Hey, how you doing? You back? Oh, yes. Okay, so I think I got it working now. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. I, I was going to do your build, and I found that I don't have a cricket, and I don't have a, a trigger. <laughs> Oh, okay. But I could do other stuff. Yeah, that's, that's fine. And, yeah. And I was, I mean, with you gone, I was going to make fun of your build. Because you weren't here. So, I, <laughs> um. Okay. Yeah, but now that you're here, maybe I'll be more nice. <laughs> <So. laughs> Alright, so we got this thing. Uh, Neely, do you want to do raids? I don't know. People don't like to see raids on stream. I think raids is something that... It's the one thing I feel like I'm really good at, but people just hate it. So, um... Oh man, Reefer, your cat, your brothers and sisters didn't make it. Well, I'm, I'm glad you have a little kitty. That's really cool. Uh, you still there, my friend? Alright, he is having problems, so I guess I'll continue. Um, so, in general, let's talk about synergy. Um, this is fine, and you can totally run with this, but uh, if you're starting from scratch and you have the parts, you want to synergize. Now, he has here a Cheetah, Torero, Crickets, and Trigger. Um, so, what synergizes? Neely, that's fine. Please do, Neely. I'm happy with that. So, what synergizes? Not a whole lot. Now, Torero can synergize with Crickets and Trigger. Um, Alright, CBRD, thanks for being here. Appreciate that, man. So, um, that does kind of synergize with Terrell because of the accuracy. And what I think that means in general is um, the time to line up your trigger hair. I think that's considered accuracy in this game. So that is cool, but uh, you have here a cheetah that doesn't do a lot as far as synergy. It gives you speed. And I just want to see here, if I assemble this, uh, it has a top speed here of 120 kilometers an hour, which is a lot. I take this away, now it's 100, so it adds 20 onto your speed. But what about the other things? A hot red is uh, zero energy, and it gives you 13 extra. So that's still pretty decent, but it's so it gives you the extra energy. And it synergizes with your reloading weapons. So I definitely think Hot Red would be a better fit. And uh, what else? Colossus also for reloading um, costs you an extra energy. It doesn't do a lot for speed at all, but it's great for reloading. And my favorite, which I never get to play, is Oppressor, which does a lot for reloading and also tacks on as much speed as the hot red, so that's pretty decent. And it's fun, because you gotta be fast to help this perk, reloading perk happen. I like it. So I would say um, probably Cheetah wouldn't be as good as a hot red, because you want to synergize with reloading weapons. Uh, so I would do that. Uh, what else? So it's an odd, I know it's an odd mix with the trigger and the cricket, but some people just make this stuff work. I'm not really gonna criticize for 
a really interesting choice of weapons. But I will talk about construction here. So first of all, there's a lot of grills here. You there? Is my uh, potato working right? I don't know. I hear you. <laughs> that's good. Okay, that, that's a step forward. Good. I'm just, I mean, when you're gone, I just talk. Talk, 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 talk. Yeah, yeah, no. So, no. uh... Oh, uh, you're good. Okay. Yeah, I'm just disappointed. I'm sorry. My laptop right now. That's what I'm using. Oh, well. Well, at least you're... We hear you, right? You guys hear him, yep. so that's good. So, I'm inviting you to a group. And, uh, Neely Bobber wanted to join, too. So All right. Let's see if Neely is around. He's a really, really cool guy. Neely, are you there? All right, Neely, uh, let me know in-game. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, Neely, you're very welcome. Let's see if he's around. Um, how are you, sir? Are you still there? No. All right, Icebreaker is kind of going in and out. Yeah. Oh, you're, you're kind of there in and out, yeah. So, but that's cool. I'll I'll just keep talking. You ready to play? Let's see when he gets something. Oh, Neely Bobber. Let me find Neely. I'm, Neely, I'm not your friend. That's that's insane. That's bad. Let's fix that, shall we? Uh, Neely Bobber slash you two. Are you there? Yes, there he is. One moment. Let me invite Neely. Cool man. So you are invited very much. And so this is from Icebreaker Prime once again. And once hey, again, you there you are. OK, great. Awesome. Once again, this is Icebreaker's channel. So please go here and subscribe. He is almost there to 1,000. So please let us. So there's Neely. Hello there. Hey, Neely. Let me invite Neely. And I lost Icebreaker. Let's invite you again. And we will see. Um, cool, everyone's ready? Okay, so I will hold off on the um, making fun of his build. And uh, we shall play. Let me get Mad Max Mini. We're playing at a really low power score of 6,000-ish. Except for Neely, who is... Uh, Gonna cause us problems nearly, but I'm I'm cool with that. So what I got here is a very nice build, one of my favorites, only scaled down for the power score. Uh, this has three instead of four triggers, and it's got a Trero cab, and it's strong. Triggers are freaking strong. I really one of my favorite weapons for sure, and it also kind of helps for yes. Yep, 6k. We are at 6k. Yeah. And this does really well on the new Survivor game mode as well. Here's the big version. This has the Apollo and four triggers. And it's just solid. It's got fuel on the bottom. Very well protected. And I love it. So I scaled it down for the 6k so I can play with my friends over here. But still, man, pit triggers are super powerful. Thanks, man. That is really good. I do like it a lot. A lot of bumpers in the front. And um, the one thing, I, I could definitely improve this by having small tracks, for sure. I love being able to go backwards and keep on shooting. You can't do that with wheels so much. But what you can do with this build is just kind of attack and turn around and shoot behind as I'm running away. That also is totally viable. So I like that. Uh, what happened? Did I lose the thing? No, we're ready. Neely is at 54. Okay. But he's also super good, so I'm not worried about him so much. He's not ready. He's still putting on stuff. All right. How, got, how do you think about the Survivor League anyway? Discord keeps uh, being weird on me. I'm sorry. Well, we'll play yep. soon anyway. We'll, we'll be in game, so that'd be cool. Yeah, that's a lot of bumpers on this thing, man. <laughs> Maybe that's way too much, I think, but that's a lot of bumpers. But fuel is—it's crucial. You gotta bumper up your fuel. That is 
you just got to do that. That's just really important. Thanks, Neely. Appreciate that. Um, so while we're waiting, let me make fun of him again. <laughs> I am extremely confused right now. What? I don't oh, understand. With your stuff? Why it keeps cutting out on me. It's oh. very bizarre. Discord is... It, it can do that. It, yeah. It could be... Um, just kind of bandwidth issues. You know, you have a lot of stuff using the internet right now. All right, so cool. We are ready. We're all ready. Nice. All right, so the fuel. Um, you got to bumper that stuff. Survivor League is, yeah, Green Apple. It's really sad. I, it's really fun. It's like a, a serious six-person clan wars with strangers. Um... Unfortunately, hey Neely, killer wedge, man, scary. Unfortunately, you only get those little badges. Very sad. Oh, thanks, Crash and Trash. Um, hey, Icebreaker, do you have noise reduction switched on Discord? Maybe that could um, cause you to come out. Let's just take care of some bots easily. Oh, crap. Here they are. Hello. Oh, no. This guy's scary. Look, he's going to chew my butt up. Oh, my God. That was scary. Holy crap. <laughs> wow. I thought I was going to lose my butt there. Literally. That was terrifying. <laughs> he just lost his taste for me, I guess. Let's get weapons off him. Uh, that could be hard to do. Those are some pretty solid... Um... Oh, God. That was terrifying. That's a lot of melee on that guy. Oh my god. That was I was not even paying attention at all. I'm just talking here. Bam! Bam. Blow up. You're on fire. Blow. Blow up. Hold still. Thank you. Sheesh. And just drive through a fence. No problem. Dragon. I don't know how I survived. That would, have been a, that would have been a real humiliating kind of death. <laughs> Holy crap. Um, yeah, we Lee should, they should just... I uh, hear you again. Uh, do you have your noise reduction switched on in Discord? Maybe go to your settings. Yes, and try to... I just switched that off. Cool, that could do it. Yeah, that could do it. Thank you, Hurricane, for helping out. Yeah. How do Hurricane's we do anyway? a really close friend of mine. Yeah, yeah that's cool. Glad you have a... Moderate. I don't even have a moderator. <laughs> turkey, turkey's up here. All right. So what I was saying about um, Mad Dog is I could see your fuel. I could see it, man. That's oh yeah. That really scares me. And you're, yeah, and uh, and you're so wedged up that it's really from the back. You can really, really see the fuel. So um, yeah. I would I would cap that all around with some armor at least, for sure. And if you have things like a build where the top it's it's kind of so kind of wedged, you might want to actually tuck the fuel a bit higher, not one level below your frames, you know, like really hide it in there. But mm -hmm. fuel is a, a big liability. So, um, so I shouldn't really have it. Well, everyone says have fuel. That's how you make money in cross out, which it helps a little bit. But if you're it makes you lose your battles because you blow up, then it's worth not having it. Now, um, okay. this has fuel on the bottom, but it's bumpered up. But if I start dying a lot, I'll just take it off and just continue. Now, when I have, definitely when I have Goliaths, like this guy, or if I have armored tracks, like this guy, mm -hmm. I definitely have fuel there because you can't take it off. You can't even. That was something I was actually going to try to do was put some Goliath tracks on it and make it look like the Peacemaker nice. Mad Max movie. That's cool. Yeah, that actually was one of my intentions that I had later on for yeah, this particular yeah. build. I saw a video that talked about all of the actual vehicles from the movie, and some of them were just for looks. And that was one vehicle they couldn't even really get to work. <laughs> they just, <laughs> you see it in yeah. the movie. <laughs> Yeah, but uh, it didn't get a lot of action, per se. Yeah. 
Yeah. Because it was just impossible. It was a nightmare. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, but with Goliath and with, with those kind of tracks, definitely have fuel every time because you are really protected. Otherwise, fuel can be very tricky. It might not be worth it. You have to just see if you're dying or not. Uh, Green Apple, the build uh, is called Mad Max that he's using. There you go. This is Mad Max. And the one I'm using is Dirky Mad Max. So they're pretty similar. This is Mad Dog. Oh, sorry. Mad Dog. You have Mad Dog. I have Mad Max. So. Yeah, all my stuff is usually Dirky. Dirky something. It is. When you really take a look at it, it is actually a pretty beautiful build. Absolutely. That, yeah. But I was talking before about um, synergy, right? Yeah, yeah. So um, you definitely want to look into getting a reloading engine. Yeah. And the hot red makes you go three kilometers an hour slower, which is not bad. But it helps you reload your weapons. Um, are you ready? Yeah, still, I'm ready. Still building. Okay. Ready up. Let's ready up and let's go. What made you think of that combination? It's awesome. Um, honestly, it's pretty much what I had. That was I was like, why not try something new? And so I slapped him on there and me, you know, just I, I don't know. That's history. Cool. I mean that. I mean, yeah. It's I don't know why it. <laughs> People come up with these crazy synergies and it, they just practice with them and it works for them. And yeah. I can totally see the trigger heating up and then crickets doing more damage because of the heated parts. So yeah, it's really cool. It just works. Hey, JC, you like it? Thank you. So this one's got no... Uh, I don't think I have a generator in here. I'm pretty sure I don't. Wee. There we go. Let's see what happens. <gasps> yeah, Goliath missed Bastion. I did that. Did you see that? That was horrible. I don't. Yeah, I don't know, but sadly they got. They. It shouldn't have been a thing. Hello. Can you help you out a little bit, man. I'm right behind you. Oh God, hover guy. Not good. Not good. Don't like him. Let's go. Oh, he's totally after me, man. Oh, no! Oh, I thought that was a friendly guy. Nope, I was wrong. Hey, you're still alive? Cool. Oh, not much. Not much longer, though. <laughs> I got him. Oh, I got Lance right behind me trying. Oh. This Lance is trying no. to get me. He's trying really hard to get me. I, I can't. I'm sorry, I gotta Good let this guy not, not lance me. <laughs> Man, that lancer was trying to steer badly, but fortunately couldn't manage it. Oh god, other guy. Getting him. I'm getting him. I'm getting him a little bit. Come on. We got him. Alright, this is good. Phew. Damn, that was close game. Neely, you're dead! Oh, another guy. I thought we were done. Damn. Neely's dead! Yeah, that was horrible. Goliath, Ness, Bastion, I G -G. did that. Uh, GG, man. MVP, what the hell? Mad Max, 119. Good job, man. There's so much Mad Max in this game right now. You got, you're a Mad Dog, yeah. I am got a Mad Do Max. Oh my god. Um, yeah. Neely, what happened, man? <laughs> Neely is, uh, he's not used to the 6K, right? Let me try something new real quick. I want to see oh, okay. something new. Okay. It'll be real quick, though. Sure. What else can you do at 6K? I actually don't go much farther than 8K in PvP. I don't know. I just don't find it. Yeah. I don't think it's any more fun to be in 10,000 and higher. I just don't. Mm. 
You shall just do this thing and clean up. <laughs> Horrible bastion goblin thing. It's so bad. And Argus, because you have to. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Come on, today, today, today. Come on. You can make it. You can make it. Phew. This is really scary. Oh my god. Oh, my nose is bleeding. Oh, look at that old dam. That's interesting. I didn't notice that. Whee! Yipes. Scary. Right, where are we? Well, yeah, Red Sus, uh, that's the thing. Um, heavy builds, they work better. They just work a hell of a lot better in PvP. So when I'm grinding, I always use the heavy builds. I always use tank treads, and I always get my fuel. But honestly, I think it's more fun to have light builds. When I really do want to have fun, I'll do something else. And this is kind of, this is a really good trade-off. I get some fuel... It's good success rate. Triggers are really strong. Um, but yeah, but I would say yeah, go for the heavy builds for sure if you want to win. But these are a lot more fun. A lot more fun. Only crap. We. Ouch. Not ready. Yeah, what else could I do really? Hmm. I have a cohort spider thing, but that's. Seven, eight. Yeah, Crash, I'm, I, I totally with you. I, I didn't do anything for the longest time. It didn't interest me in the slightest. Then I said, well, let me just at least see how high I could build it. And that's all the inspiration I got from that. So it gives a good place to do screenshots. I don't even know how I got these things, where they came from. Oof. I have to practice using wheels. I'm so used to tracks these days. There we go. Winner! The winner! <laughs> Alright, Icebreaker, it's on you. Sorry about that. Yeah, I'm getting one thing set up real quick. No problem. Let's see, what else can I So, Birky, what I have done is probably one of the weirdest things I've done in this game. Oh, yeah? Cool. I'm inspired. <laughs> Let's see what you got. Alright. Did you change the PS at all? No, you're... Okay. Oh, now you're 75. What is this thing? Triggers again. This is bizarre to say the least. Okay. Well, let's see what you got. I think Neely is also building stuff. All right, all right, all right. I'm ready. Okay. Yeah, light builds are faster. We should add a little bit more. See what I can do with weaponry. Oh, now you're 81. Okay. Yeah, all I did pretty much was add a bunch of uh, armored tracks to my vehicle. Okay. Yeah, this thing, um, it's thing fits the power score, but it's not fun to, it's not fun, this is just my grinder, my daily grinder, so, good, very good success rate, but not really fun, it just does the job. What else do yeah. I have? Let's see. I wish they gave you the power score 
in the view here. Oh, incinerator, wasp, maybe. What else I got? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, I could also do hulks. That's more interesting, right? Because I'm bad with them. And that's so good with cannons, so I'll try it just to. <laughs> it's more amusing. But you kind of have to have an Argus these days if you're going to have cannons. I'll give it a shot, so to speak. Right. In theory, this should be better. Oh, now you're 9k. Okay. <laughs> okay, what? that's pretty much it. What, what I can do with thing, that. Uh, okay. In that case, let me do the Goliath version. Hey, Vasil, how you doing, man? So I just recently got the Goliaths, and <laughs> how you doing, Vasil? I don't get why people aren't flipping me, because that's all I do. The Goliaths is just flip them all over the place. But they, I, they don't quite seem to do the same thing to me. I don't, I don't know. I think people are just too scared of Goliaths, honestly. Really? Yeah. They really don't scare me because you, you, they get flipped so easily. Or you just focus one and blow up one Goliath. And um, if you do penetration damage, you can blow up their fuel tanks from behind the track. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not, really, I'm not really scared of them, but... Playing with them, it does kind of feel OP, though. Honestly, Jerky, I don't know what I created. But I'm in love with it. You know, what? Okay. I'm in love with this thing. This thing is bizarre. I like this. Well. Ooh, okay. Let's try it. Four armored tracks. Nice. Well, it looks beautiful. Hmm. Ah, interesting. Yeah, I don't know. Um, I don't know how four armor tracks really work. I haven't really played with four of them. But when you're playing the other game mode, you guys ready? Ready up? Oh, sorry. No yeah, problem. When I was playing that uh, the other game mode with the uh, what do you call it the tank game mode, um, four armor tracks was very hard to turn, but we'll give it a shot. You probably exceeded the mass limit. What? Uh oh. <laughs> oh, I was not paying attention. Yeah, that's the thing about tracks. The head. Uh -oh. Yeah, I tried two of them though. That should be fine. Yeah, two of them would be good. Are just slow. I went with four of them. Got a golden eagle in here and everything, and it's still slow. Really? <laughs> Yeah, PS is going up, man. Wait, now you're down to 78. Should have paid attention to that. That's no, cool. I mean, whatever you whatever you settle on, we will um we will trim down to. All right. Well, this is what I've settled on. Okay. Getting ready up now. So that's about 8k. I'm going to go back to... Let's try cannons because they're funnier. Uh.
if you fuse Golden Eagle for speed, I guess you could, but yeah, I don't I don't really get to fuse a lot of epics, and it's scary to do that. So. Hey, Durky, do you have a favorite cabin? I completely forgot to ask you that. Sure. Well, um, yeah. It could be by because of looks or by performance or both. All right. Uh, for the sounds of the horn and the engine and everything else and the looks, Tusk. Tusk? Is a favorite. Cerberus okay. is also a favorite for that, for looks and sound and that kind of thing. Um, but not really for playing at all. Uh, for yeah. playing, um, as long as you have the weapons for it, I think um, favorite is the best. Otherwise, um, I'm also a big fan of Growl. Not Growl, Howl. <laughs> Take this thing out, Birky. Yeah. Nice. I love it. Half track. Yeah. Looking good. I attached four of these things on there. And it kinda... <laughs> I think that would stop you from turning at all. Yeah. So you'd be stuck. You wouldn't be moving much. Oh, goodness. Damn. Oh, here they are. I found them. Oh, goodness. Daniel. Thank you. Whoa. Close one. I found the guys. Oh crap, he's got a cannon already. Whoops, went over his head. Oh god, cannon be gone. <laughs> Alright. I'm stuck with no weapons now. Oh, I'm distracting this guy though. There you go. No! <laughs> Help me nearly! <laughs> nearly just exploded in my face. Crap. No! Oh, that's an interesting looking thing. It's got... It's a tripod or something. Whoa! It's still functioning. <laughs> we got slaughtered. <laughs> they raise a PS of ML200. These people use three legs in low PS matches. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. It's a little too bad. You can't just kind of throw legs on anything these days. But I'm not a big fan of legs anyway, honestly. Some people really love them, but I don't really see the point of slowing yourself down. Oh, I am. my power score is way too higher than yours now. So that's not good. Not that it matters that much, because look, they're all over the place. Alright, focus spiders, you got it. I'm just with you, Neely. I'm gonna hang out with you. Here they come. Here's the spiders. And there you are. Got him a little bit. Sheesh. Very little bit. Alright, so Neely's going in. Let me cover him. There you go. I'll cover you, Dirty. Yeah, we're just trying to get the spider. I'm being cooked. Asus, thank you. Still hitting him. Oh god, I'm being cooked again. No! Behind. Yep. Ouch. <laughs> Argus this only gets goes. to use once, really. When you fight a quad sledgehammer or quad mace, shoot the middle wheel. They got gas gen under there. That's cool. Thank you, Basil. Yeah, it's not the legs that make it OP. It's the legs, the like, weapon they got on it. That's very true. But when I play them, I just find that they just get too top-heavy and don't have much benefit to having legs. I don't know. It's not like they're impervious to melee, they're not. Icebreaker is the last one standing. Nice guy. Yeah, but not for long. I'm dead. Let me see if I can lower the power score a little bit. Uh, what else can I use anyway? Let's see. 
Mm. Well, that was awful. Let's see if we can add some more armor pieces. Okay. Yeah, I think this is good enough. Yeah, this will be fine. This will carry at least. Do, 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 do. See, yeah, this is like this is all I really play with these days. This one right here is boring. Three, three legs intactly is OP, yeah. I do want to try Takris one day. There's so much in this game that I haven't been able to play with. It's it's, it's amazing. Yeah, I don't even have anything machine just vectors for machine guns. Mm -hmm. Not much. I got a taupe. <laughs> That's hilarious. That was kind of fun. I want to try it. But it's five energy. Let's try this one. So, do you want to stick together as like a, a mini squad? Or... Oh yeah, absolutely. All right. Uh, do you want to take uh, point? We're not going. We're going. We're going to cap though. Yeah. Okay. We're, we're not going to win this battle because there's uh, there's only three against the whole team, but Neely's Neely's not coming. So. Yeah. This I I really hate this map. This isn't my least favorite of all because of this. Oh yeah. Because of this part right here. And either you all it really splits up your team. Oh, here comes missiles at you. Look out. Well, I just take the whole front of that. That's okay. Yeah, next time stay behind me cuz I have the Argus. Yeah, that hmm. This map really just splits up your team for you in a bad way. There you go. Yeah. Sorry. Well, at least there. I still have my trigger. Uh oh. Hey man, how are you doing? No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. <laughs> Alright, I'm almost dead, but I'm still here. Nice. Hey, good job, man. You just landed right on top of him. That'll do it. There we go. Goddamn tusks. <laughs> there he comes again. Look out. <laughs> oh god, this is so bad. I'm Split. almost dead. Yep. <laughs> I took a lot of punishment that game. <laughs> Getting coffee? Yes, please, Crash. I'll have the coffee. Still got a trigger. Oh, man, your hey. gen, your gen oh. is right is right there, man. That's going to blow up your face. Or your butt. Yeah. But it didn't. You know, See? It didn't. <laughs> So that's good. Really what I should do is really rethink about or rethink my placement of my generator that I have right now. Well, yeah. You could. It's it's like all just hanging out in the back there. I slept at on so I have a little <laughs> yeah. bit more power. Yeah, people can see it though. I mean it's it's a target. Have you tried landmines and Skinner and Bastion? That's that's horrible. That's evil, 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 evil. It looks fun though. Yeah, me too, Neely. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go soon. I think. Maybe one more game. No, I haven't tried landmines. They don't seem amazingly powerful unless you do have that kind of build that can pull anything into you. That's just evil. <laughs> You make people sad with that one. Really sad. Come. 
Tusk again. That tusk is scaring me though. It's gonna come around again. Oops. No problem, no problem. Just take it slow. You got people on the right. Yeah. Let's let them come in. Here he is, clipped. Now. Grab the star. Boom. This guy. Why? Let's go right in his face. Good. Now. You got a hover coming in? Yeah, that hover is going to be a problem for me. Yeah. Zoom. Ah, there's a dude. Just ignore the hover now. <laughs> yep. Oh, this guy again. Ow, 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 ow. That really is... Machine guns are a good counter to me. Because they can just shut up my goblins if they know what they're doing. Victory! Alright, so Basil. See you, Basil. Neely! MVP. Good job, man. Neely, you playing one more game? If we can, that'd be cool, but I don't know if Neely is in. All right, one more. Here we go. Yeah, it's too bad I have to play this thing though. This is what I always play. I want to work on leveling up my uh, vehicle more, getting some more Arts and stuff like that, and sure, you, you know, more. I guess you could say, tense matches, right? Yeah. Okay, here we go. We're all in. This time. Even with the even with the half track, this uh, the boat is still decently fast. Nice. Oh yeah. Well, Terrero is is super, and you got the cheetah too, still right. Yeah. Yeah. That'll do it. Man, I'm going all in now. That's not amazingly smart. But here we are. <laughs> oh no, tusked. I got tusked. <laughs> I just realized I went off all by myself. Smack. Jasper, how are you, man? How you doing, Jasper? Good to see you. Is that a year? Holy crap. That's how long, wow, that's how long I've been doing this too. That's insane. Oh, we got Nowaysis. He's a cool guy on the other team. Let's see where Neely is. Hover Master. I wish I could play Hover so badly. I don't know what it is, but I just don't want to do it. I don't even want to try. He's good. Wow. Nova too. He's shooting the goblins, which is... Yep, that's how you do it. They're staying on though, they are not coming off. Man. He's gonna shoot up his cameras on fire. Yes! <laughs> yeah. Good job, Neely. Yeah. <laughs> tusk is funny. <laughs> that tusk, yeah, I, I could not avoid the tusk. He was coming right at me. That was hilarious. What are you gonna do, right? Yeah. Yeah, just don't let them cap, boys. Hold on, what kind of cabin is that? I don't remember that being in the last time I played. Which one, Nova? Yeah, with Neely Bobber. The... Yeah, that's an, a legendary cab. It gives you a shield, but the shield is only for two seconds or so. It's pretty short-lived, but it's it's like an Aegis. Let's... Oh, there you go. We're, we're fine cap-wise. So he can just focus on getting weapons, and we're good. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Maya, yeah. Oh no, yeah. <laughs> I was a t he was carrying it. He was totally carrying that game. That was a hard job. Yeah. This is the end. Now what is this with the uh, piercers? Cool guy. Yeah. I think for looks, personally, I really do enjoy everything from Dawn's Children. From Dawn's the Children. Cat. Yeah. 
Yeah, absolutely. For looks, sure. Absolutely. Thank you, Neely, for all those games. That was awesome. See you around, man. That's I have a friend sure. who's trying to get into the game. Mm -hmm. uh, what would you say would be the best faction to go in for, for mostly PvP? Going into it at, you know, in 2020, you know. Oh, how do you start the, the factions? Yeah, uh, he hasn't. I don't think he started the faction yet, but mm -hmm. uh, what would you recommend for him? Well... Good question. Um, as far as armor, uh, nomads is probably going to be your best because they're mid range. They're mid range. You definitely need those parts, and you also get really good stuff like the small plow. Yeah, so that's very important. Lunatic Lunatic's armor is total garbage. Just total garbage. It just mm -hmm. falls off. Unless you want to be just the fast guy, it's really not worth it. And scavenger's armor is way too heavy. So. This is way too heavy. So for armor, you really want nomads, and also for the um... all right, JC. Good to see you, man. Be right back in a bit. Cool, man. Cool, cool. So, um, so that's as far as armor. But then think about. I really think that people should think about what they want, and I think people should actually do some research. Go to YouTube and see what weapons you want to get, because you might have to start out by crafting. It's not hard to craft rares because you just need to place some raids and get some copper right you need some scrap yeah. and it's not hard to, to craft this stuff so think about what you want to craft right so yeah. um so in that vein it might be best to start off with nomads to get some decent armor um yeah let's see where is that because um, that's what i started off with was nomads so what i would say is stay with nomads uh by level two you've unlocked the small plow and that's tremendous mm -hmm. so you probably so after you get maybe level five ish or something like that, then you want to start to get all the like just switch back and forth to get all the armor bits to go back and forth. Um, Lunatics does have some good bumpers, so uh, and they also have um, light frames. So you have more frames, you have more bumpers. That's a good deal. So don't stay with any one faction for too long. Kind of go back and forth, and then think about what you want to craft. Now, in Lunatics, you definitely want to craft the Growl because it's... I mean, I, the Growl is the rare cabin, right? Because you have 11 yeah. energy, and none of the other ones are great anyway. So, I mean, it's Growl is squishy, but they're all not great. So I definitely get the Growl. You might want to get the big G starting out for some more energy, maybe. You can kind of hold off on it. And um, so that's not good to have. And then... Let's see, nomads. Like, if you like machine guns, then go to vectors, and that's about it, really. And if you want to, you can get racing wheels. Those are decent starter wheels, but you're probably okay with mediums for a long time. And yeah, scavengers is yeah. Judge, not really worth it. Not really worth okay. it for the beginning. Yeah, I would say scavengers is not worth it from the beginning at all. Because large wheels is not great for you. Trucker is not good. The judge is not amazing. You can get like you can get um, little boys just from your engineers. So that's a pretty good cannon to start out with. Yeah, so that's what I would say. All right. Yeah. What thank else? You. What else? What else? What else? Yeah. I mean, after that, I was stuck in in fire starters for the longest time just cuz they have such cool stuff and I'd I'd be stuck in fire starters crafting everything. So um Yeah, I like fire starters too, Crash. I was just stuck there cuz I mean, the the back cab is really good cuz it's 11 energy plus it's more health than the growl a little bit. Uh shivs are great wheels, junk bows are fun to start out with. You can get the, the Pyralids from the boss. So, yeah, it's a cool faction to stay in. And then there's a lot of good epics in Firestarters for sure. So, yeah. All right, you want to do oh Fidget or Equalizer and combo with Aurora? That's an interesting combination. Yeah. Uh, you want to do one more? Yeah. With uh, something? Yeah. You want to do something different or what do you have? You want to play with something else? Um, 
Uh, this is pretty much the only build that I have. That I can run. I mean, I can run the Giga Charger, but the thing with the Giga Charger is that it's not really weaponized. It only it, it has a chameleon. And that's it. Oh, that's it. Okay. Or I could I could go back with my OG. You, you know, if you want to see it in action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the Ranger, if that's something you're interested in. Yeah, let's do it. Absolutely. What power score is it? All right. It is. Give me one moment, please. Uh, I'm going to save the one that I'm working on right now. Jasper, what are you playing these days? I'm curious. I'm definitely curious. Oh, you want to stay with this one that you have right now? You All right, hold on. Let me see what I can do here. It's a good thing I uploaded it too. So I still have it. Alright, so this is my man's channel in the chat. Please go to that and give it a sub. Thank you, Dirky. Appreciate sure, it. Sure, sure, sure. And I like how you you do different things too. Yeah, I, I try That's I try doing different things, you know, here and there. Oh, you're playing Warface? You know. I haven't played Warface. Okay, so here it is. I found the ranger. Okay. I probably should remove those shield barrels. I want to live longer, like you said. So it was 2818? Oh, we're, it's going to go much lower when you take out the, the barrels. So let's see. I might have to do a starter car with you. <laughs> Sorry for being like such a low level. I have not tried League of Legends. My brother did that for a while, but he said it was kind of toxic. Um, I think he kind of gave up on it. All right, there it is. You're all set? Okay, let me really quickly get something stupid. It's been so long since I used this thing. That's what I'm going to do. There you go. There you go. There you go. And what else can we do to this puppy? Slap stuff. And let's get all the ducks. Duck. 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 Okay. I'm just going to build a couple of things real quick and then we're going to head out. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Do, do, do. Can you suggest websites of other YouTube channels to get great frame layouts? Oh, frame layouts. What? Oh. Frame layouts. Tree Burgers, I think, is really good at that, honestly. I like Tree Burgers. He's a pretty good YouTuber as well. Yeah. And then some guys on my Discord are really good at frames, frame layouts. Um. I mean, I'm pretty okay, but I don't really have a video showing just that. Um, this is stupid. Is this too high of a power score? I just, How you know, up a it? little bit. It is five, five k. Oh, five k. Oh, hello. Yeah, I just added the generator, an engine, and a few of my guns on there. Okay. Because I, I don't really have the the drones anymore, oh. unfortunately. Yeah, sorry about that. That's, a, that's cool. Let's just change this up a little bit then. Thanks for playing with me, man. I appreciate it. Oh, it's fun. Absolutely. Let us do something really stupid. And 
Yeah, tote is a really fun weapon that I have not even close to mastered. I could talk about frame layout after a game, briefly though, or I can try doing that. If you guys want to do that. Not like I'm the master of it, but I could try. Alright, let's see. Sorry about that, Jersey. I'm not much of a huge talker. What? No, what, 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 what? No, that's cool. I'm just talking to, um, people in chat are asking about frame layouts. And, yeah. Um, I, uh, I know a good, I feel like I know a good deal about it, but I haven't really, um, covered that a whole lot. So, maybe I'll save, I'll stay behind after this and talk a little bit about that. Let's do something else that would help our team, Maxwell. There we go. Uh, oh, energy. So I could do something else. Let's see. Um, Annihilator is horrible. <laughs> Can I do that? <laughs> I don't know. No. Falcon? Yeah, maybe I'll do this a little bit. Hmm. Why does this not look right to me? Oh well. Yeah, going into this, hey, I'm fairly it. confident that this build is not going to be necessarily super effective. Yeah, you should see what I got. Yeah, I have your stream pulled up right now. Look at that thing. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's always fun. I'll try it. <laughs> I will try it. I mean, now that you have these little one these little thin frames it's really good to have kind of frame redundancy so if they shoot part of your frames they don't blow out your whole bottom so that's one thing you can do with really long builds holy crap this is scary ow 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 <laughs> well, that was fun hmm all right you ready yep Ready up. Alright, well, this might be the last game. We'll see if uh, if we got a decent one. Alright. If, if that's cool with you. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah, I'm going to try leveling up some more so that we can get into a little bit more interesting games. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, I, I kind of stay in between 8 and 9k myself. I think that's, for, for me, that's just kind of more interesting. I feel like in the higher power scores, it's just, it's all spaced yeah. out hover. It's like Clan Wars. I mean, there's all spaced out hovers and scary stuff and cap cans everywhere. And I don't know. There it is. I remember that thing. Yeah, it's, it, I don't even think I fixed the redundancy, to be honest. It probably should have. There we go. Oh, it's cloak. Oh, crap. <laughs> Get this guy from the side. Hello. Uh, Michael. Got him a little bit. And this is where this field uses. Hello. Go. Yeah. Hello. Oh, crap. <laughs> 
<laughs> that was funny. Hello, someone's underneath me this whole time. Okay, I'm just gonna carve out a little bit of that. Thank you. Whoa, that was bad. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> hey, Junebug, how you doing, man? Good to see you, my friend. What, what, what's what shaking? All right, Jason is going to play on PS4. Cool. A Tusk over here. And so, what is the fastest cabin? Uh, I think it's Griffin. Well, it's um, it's cockpit. Which is hard to get because you have to buy a pack for it. Or it's Griffin, which is a legendary okay. cab. So those are the fast. Otherwise, uh, all the light cabs are very fast. Uh, Torero, what you have now is probably fine. That's one of the fastest cabs, and it's a medium cab. So it's probably the best one for you right now. Yeah. If that's what you like. I actually got that from... I actually did end up buying some packs for this game. There's like a little way to help boost. Yeah, frame layouts. What did you mean? You meant actual frames that your wheels go into, right? Right. I think that's what I'm talking about. Hey, someone. How you doing, man? Well, that was awful. <laughs> yeah. What, what I have is pretty bad. Um, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I can talk a little bit about Frames. Is that what we're talking about? Frames? I can do that a little bit. Let's see. Um, yeah. Talk a little bit about that. Well, let's start with what I have here. Um, yeah, let me just see what I have under here anyway. There's the layout. Yep, yeah, I mean, in general, I usually have a donut because I like to put things in frames. And um, what you should do as you build is just practice taking off certain frames and see. Um, okay, so if I lose the middle, if I lose that frame, what happens? Nothing. And just see, because if you lose one frame and everything is gone, that would be extremely bad. So um, that's what I, what I do when I build. I just kind of take stuff off and, um, and then see. But you need your cab in there, I forgot. Okay. So here are is my donut thing over here, and I'll just practice. So let's see if I'm, if someone shoots this side frame. Let's see, they shoot me from the side. Uh, what happens? Nothing. I'm still good. So I kind of talk about redundancy a lot. So here we're talking about redundancy. Um, this middle frame, um, if it's shot, I still have this other frame inside that will keep my other wheel alive. Okay. So instead of just um, having nothing here, and then another wheel, um, I have another frame over there just to make sure, because this is a good spot to shoot at, the middle right here. Um, I could actually use a smaller frame to hide that, I don't know. So that's what I would say, is just kind of go here and just take off stuff and see. Okay, so that's one frame over there. Um, problem is when you have frames that are so far from the cab, which you have like really long builds, that's when you get into trouble. So, let's see. Yeah, so people who do this, they just make really long builds and it's far from the cab and they'll put wheels all around here. And the problem is that you're shot over here and everything is gone. So if you have long stuff like that, what you can do is, um, is use just redundant frames. So here's one in the middle, right? And then if I want more wheels on here, I can do something like, there's gonna be a wheel there, there's gonna be a wheel there, and have an extra middle layer or something like that. And that way, this is just a random tip by the way, a completely random tip. So that way, if things are shot off, you still have this thing over here, right? If you're shot in the middle, you still have your front. You see? So that's just a random tip. Otherwise, I just kind of make donuts out of my frames um, and try to make sure that the frames are touching the cab. So both for the hind wheels and the front wheels, I try to make sure that one of them is actually 
contacting the cab. Um, someone mentioned that yes, an explodey will blow up a lot of your frames and you'll be lost, but I don't know. Not that much to say about that right now, but I might want to do. Um, yep, spider web frames is also a good thing. And in general, I think light frames just have less HP. It's not really worth it. So if your weight is not killing you, then just use the heavier frames. There's no point in having a lighter frame with less HP unless you really have to. I have them over here for some reason, but yeah. Anyway, but that could be like a separate video or something. I can really think about that if you have um, a lot of specific questions about frames. I can maybe tackle that and we can see where we go. But yeah, that's all I got for now. All right, folks, I'm going to head out. Thank you guys for being here. Really appreciate that. Hello to my friend, um, Icebreaker Prime. And please, Hello. Go, yep, please go to his channel for sure. Thank you for playing, man. That was fun. Hey, no problem. Thank you. Appreciate yeah, yeah. It. Thanks for hanging out. And uh, have a no great problem. rest of your weekend. You and, too. Uh, everyone, please uh, stay safe. Continue staying safe, Rikos. And um, I'm getting tired. Yeah, thank you, guys. I can't talk anymore. I'm tired. <laughs> yeah.